And the snow is a welcome sight for Michigan ski hills, especially one that's just got a multi-million dollar upgrade. Alyssa Fenske has more from Mount Brighton. With all the snow that we've been getting over the last couple of days, it just seems like a, a great time to pull the kids out of school for a day. Showing her kids how to ski just like her parents taught her. Nancy Livingston was pleasantly surprised by all the upgrades this year. Really nice to see the new magic carpets instead of the tow rope. All new boxes and rails, uh, new grooming machines. The whole inside is just totally redone. Ten million dollars of improvements have been put into Mount Brighton Ski Resort, making it one of the top winter destinations in mid-Michigan. New chairlifts, terrain parks, and state-of-the-art snowmaking system. It was a complete overhaul after Vail Resorts took over ownership last December. The hill officially opened for season on Saturday. So far, I've seen a huge improvement on people that I normally see here. People are spreading the word, saying, telling their friends to come out here and it's been really good business so far. The snow that came over the weekend has made this an ideal opening week. It left a bunch, bunch of powder, like probably six inches, I would say. And uh, after they got done grooming, it, just, it I mean, it came out like this. It came out perfect. Even with the latest snowstorm, not all the runs are open yet, but hopefully with a little more help from Mother Nature and, of course, the snow machines, they'll be open next week. For Livingston, as long as the new Children's Ski Center is open, they're set. Well, for us, it's great. It gives the kids a lot more control when they're learning. There's no big humps of snow. In Brighton, Alyssa Fenske, Fox 47 News. The downtown area was one of the main reasons that Vail picked that resort for the upgrades. They'll offer affordable packages as well for beginners, which include lessons, equipment, and a ski pass.